In January 2008, Academy subject matter experts Thomas and Penny Power had their knowledge productized for global release. The video you're about to watch is the result of that process. To find out how to create your own line of knowledge products for global monetization, or to view videos from other knowledge experts, visit www.productizeyourself.com. Now the next thing I want to go to, I'm going back to a profile, is I want to come down here and look at these first two lines here. See there it says social networking guide, chairman of academy, public speaker, non-executive director, phone me on my telephone number anytime to arrange a meeting. Now if I just jump out here and I jump into Google, we now live in a word where people Google you. It's become a verb, to Google, you know, a doing word, where people Google you. So if I were to put my name into Google, type it in like that, just zoom in so you can see I've put my name there into Google, and then I click on search. The first thing that comes up there is my profile. There you can see it. And there you can see the first two lines that I just showed you from my profile appearing top of Google. Now, you want to be able to manage what people read about you when they search for you, when they Google you. And we live in a world where now where everyone is Googling you before they meet you. They Google you before they meet you. So they're going to find your profile on Academy top of Google, first of all, and then they're going to look and read those words. So they instantly know something about me. Very, very brief. It's only about 100 characters, but they know my background, what I do for a living, and they know my telephone number if they wish to ring me. And one of the things I found about revealing my telephone number is the more I make it available, the less people phone it because they think I'm busy. So it's actually not too bad making my phone number available. So that is to Google. So you want to be found on the system on the internet when people search for you. Now if I just go down the page and I bring up that photograph, then you want to think about what message you want to give out about yourself to the people who are reading your profile. Now your, brofo your profile is like your personal brochure. This is a personal brochure about you. Imagine you're producing a brochure about yourself. If you're producing a brochure for your organization, you'd hire an advertising agency or a design and print company. You'd have a copywriter. You'd have photography. Now this is a brochure. Your profile is a brochure about you. What messages do you want to give out about yourself to the people who read it? I want to give out the message that I'm a family man. I want to give out that message. What messages do you want to give out? What photos do you want to incorporate into your profile? What do you want to write about? Well, as Penny says earlier, one of the things that people are very interested in is who you are more so than what you do. Because people like to get to know you first. We have a saying, make friends first, make business second. People first, transaction second. Community first, commerce second. People are much more interested in who you are than what you do. An awful lot of people in networking ask the question, you know, what do you do? But people are not interested in what you do until they know who you are. So my profile talks about the journey. It talks about the journey we've been through, the thoughts, the values, the kinds of things that we think are important. What do you think is important about your journey? What do you believe in? What do you value? Who do you value? The more you can release of yourself outwards, the more you will attract people in. The more you keep it quite closed and cool and cold, the more you repel people away. And remember, you're trying to turn yourself into a magnet. You're trying to make yourself very attractive. Why are you trying to do that? Well, you've got to consider that each and every one of us in the world now is competing with the best person in that country worldwide. You know, we've got 200 countries worldwide. And in every country there's an expert as good as you at what you do. So you've got to beat at least those other 199 people. 
there's another expert in every country in the world and we're now competing in a global market you're not just competing here in the UK you're competing against every expert who knows your particular profession worldwide whatever it is so you've got to out publish them you've got to have a better profile them you've got to out find them that's how you've got to be viewed so I think as you build up this message about yourself think about what it is you want to project I think photos are a fantastic way to build your reputation to project the kind of image you want to project you need words you need photos perhaps you want to embed a YouTube video and down here you can see I've got three ladies Michelina, Michelina and uh, Malgosia and that's in Krakow in Poland where these la three ladies are building the network the Academy network in Krakow and all around Poland what messages do you want to put out people are much more interested in who you are than what you do and that really completes the image side of the profile the sort of emotional side the feeling side Thank you.